Hey guys, it's Michaela, and today I'm going to walk you through a fix for your WhatsApp video call not working. It's pretty quick and simple, so let's jump in. I'm on WhatsApp right now, and say I'm trying to make a video call, and I'm coming up and it's saying WhatsApp does not have access to your camera, and or it's coming up with a blank screen, a blank or a black screen. Um, I'm going to walk you through a couple of fixes for that. First, if this message is coming up, that means that your app doesn't have the authorization to show your camera. So you can either just click on settings and it'll bring you to the page. Or if that button's not coming up, then we're going to go out of there. We're just going to go to our settings in our phone. Once you're in settings, all you're going to do is scroll down until you find WhatsApp. Mine's at the very bottom. And then it brings you to that uh, setting, and this is where you can allow permission to the uh, the app itself. And if you can see underneath the microphone, it uses camera, and mine is toggled off. So if I toggle that back on, I'm allowing access to the camera. And so then when I go back to the WhatsApp, I should be just fine to go on the camera. Now, once I'm out of that, if it's still a blank screen, a black screen, that means there's probably a glitch on the app side of it, and all we have to do is reset the app. So to do that, we're going to go back into our settings. Go out of that. We're just going up. So back into our settings, then to general, iPhone storage. Then we're going to find WhatsApp, and we're going to offload the app. Offloading the app just kind of resets the app. It takes out any of the glitches. It's just like if you um, deleted the app and then redownloaded it from the app store. It doesn't do anything to your information, but it resets the app. So once that's reset, you can go back to the app and that should be working fine. Now, if it's still coming up with a blank screen, a black screen, uh, one thing you want to check is to make sure that your camera is working you know, on its own. So go to just your camera on your phone. And if it's still coming up to a black screen, then what I want you to do is to reset your phone completely. Um, well, before you even go reset it, you can also just try turning off the phone and turning it back on. But if that's not working, you can go into your settings and then go to general and then go down to the bottom and reset. And we want to um, reset erase all content and settings and then you just erase now and then it will back up to your backup um, if you don't have a backup then uh, you can erase and then back up uh, the first option but I would suggest you know checking if you have a backup and if you do then you can just go ahead and erase now and then back up to your old setting now in the end if all of that is not working and you're still once you've reset the entire phone and it's still coming with a black screen on your camera then it's a phone issue and you need to take it into either the apple store or your provider and tell them that you know your camera's broken it's not working and then they'll set you up with you know a method to get a new phone but that is it if you guys have any questions on that let us know in the comments below if not don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe